What's good fam? Welcome back to Cheeto's Kitchen. In today's video, we're gonna be making a pot roast. Yes, comfort food to the max. Easy to make and people are gonna love you for making it. And before we get started, show your boy some love. Hit that like button and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, hit that bell so you'll be notified every time I drop a new recipe. Appreciate it. Okay, first up, we're gonna put our seasoning together. You're gonna to need two tablespoons of salt, a half tablespoon of pepper, two teaspoons of oregano, one teaspoon of cumin, one teaspoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of garlic powder, and one teaspoon of chili powder. I'm using about four pounds of chuck roast. Make sure you rinse it off and thoroughly dry it with a paper towel. I made sure the chuck roast had a nice fat to protein ratio because that fat gives it all the flavor. Now we're gonna mix up our season blend and generously shower the chuck roast with the season. I'm talking all over, nice and good. Make sure you flip it over. There you go. Go ahead and rub it in. Thoroughly rub it in, massage it in there. Make sure you want that flavor to get in there. You know what I mean? Boom, we're gonna put the chuck roast to the side and let it marinate for a minute. In the meanwhile, we're gonna work on the veggies. We're gonna chop up one large onion, three stalks of celery. We need some minced garlic, about six cloves. And we're gonna use about a cup and a half of baby carrots. Now, heat up a pan to medium high heat. Drop in about two tablespoons of olive oil and we're gonna to start to cook our onion, celery, and carrots. Cook them up nice and good until they start to sweat. And then we're gonna add in our garlic. Once we add in that garlic, we're gonna cook it about another one to two minutes and add in a teaspoon of the Creole season. Now we're gonna add these veggies to the slow cooker. Like this is, by now, you, the flavor in the air, the aroma in the air is just ridiculous. In the same pan, we're gonna add in a little more olive oil and then we're gonna sear the chuck roast on both sides. Nice and good, about three to four minutes on both sides. Once you put it down, you don't wanna really move it at all. Just let it sear nice and good. It's okay if it crisps up a little bit on the outside. And that's what we want, cause all that is flavor. Boom, we're gonna do the same thing for the other piece. Now we're gonna add both pieces to the veggies in the slow cooker and start to prepare the gravy. Yes. Now back to the pan. It might look like it's burnt or too crispy, but trust me, that's flavor. You'll see what I mean in a second. Now we're gonna drop in two tablespoons of butter. Once it melts, we're gonna add three tablespoons of flour. Mix it up nice and good, stir it up. We're gonna cook it until we get that flour taste out of there about a minute or so. And this is how we're gonna get that pan nice and clean. We're gonna add in the red wine and it's gonna deglaze the pan. As you can see, it's already coming up. Boom, that easy. Once you mix that in nice and good, we're gonna add in two cups of chicken broth. Then add in four tablespoons of brown sugar two tablespoons of W sauce, Worcestershire sauce. You know what I'm talking about. Mix that up nice and good. Now, the final component of this gravy, and this is what's gonna give it the flavor and that color, five tablespoons of tomato paste. Stir it up nice and good. And we're gonna let it simmer just for a few minutes. And once we do that, it's time to add it to the chuck roast and veggies. Boom, pour it right in like that. Go ahead and throw in some bay leaves, some fresh thyme, and rosemary. Close the top, and we're gonna slow cook this for six hours. You really wanna go eight, but we're gonna go six hours. Flavor, upon flavor, upon flavor. All right, last thing, you wanna grab your ladle and skim all the fat off the top. I'm telling you, they're gonna love you for making this. You can serve with mashed potatoes, broccoli, or whatever combination you like. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Peace.